Hello, this is Moon and I've got another challenge log here. This is striped hyena from Giovanni with a key nicely wrapped in a Dutch lottery ticket. Let's see if we can win that one. So, let's start. One is loose. Two is binding. And just a tiny click out of it. Let's see if it moves a little bit more. It feels too much. No, it's good. Three is loose. Four is loose and five is binding. Click out of it. Now it's one. Feel set. Two is up again. Oh, that was too much. Everything dropped. So now one feels good. Two. Oh, it might be set. Let's leave it alone for now. Three. And we dropped one again. Let's start from the back. Five, four, three, two. That was two now. And one is binding. Click out of it and core rotation. One feels set, two feels set. Click out of three. Four, default set. Let's see what is holding us. One feels good. Two feels good. I think it's three. And we got an open. Let's make it 360. And pick it the other way. One is binding, just reset everything. And one is loose, two is binding. Feel set now. One feels good, two feels good, three. Sure, maybe it's fine. Maybe we have to return to it. Four is binding. Click out of it. Uh, we might have to return to it later. Five. One is good. Two is good. Three is good. Four. I think it's four now. Five is binding as well. Dropped stump. One is now loose. Two. Set. Three. Feels good. One. One feels good. Two feels good. Three feels good. Four. Five feels good. I think it's four now that still not. And again, we dropped one. Probably our setting something, and we got an open. Again, 360. And let's have a closer look at everything. We got it. So, first, here is the key. Let's see how it works. Let's see the bitting. Nice. The threes well hidden behind two. 
and the four and five are kind of middle cuts. Quite low cut here. So let's see. The key doesn't really well, take some convincing to go in, but works very well. Let's see. Here it says Geo one. Nothing here, nothing here. Grub screwed Bibles. I will, however, try to get it through the back. Let's see. Clip. I wonder whether that means that there is some modification to the Bible as well. All right, let's get these pins out. One, two, three, four, and five. Tweezers. Let's arrange them. Those are some nice pins. The core got real deep counter milling. All five chambers of it. And that's for both sides. Let's see how that how well does it fit with those pins. But it's actually drivers we have to be looking at, right? I guess we'll find some milling for those in the Bible. Some serrations on number one. I'm not sure if it's homemade or stock. They are so regular, the distance between the uh, serrations. Spring. Number two. Again serrated. I would have guessed that with such counter milling, the kind of gin like spools would have been best, but well, maybe we'll find some. And here you go deep spool. Let's see how it catches here. Eh, not much, really much more on that side, but not much on that one. I could really feel that one direction picks differently than other. A really nice counter milling, I like it. Three. Another serrated. Now I know why it's a striped hyena. And another deep spool. Uh, kind of catching, but not too much. I think the lips are not thin enough to really stain that nice groove again. Much more one side than the other. 
the last spring. Springs are pretty much the same. And I'm not sure it can be seen. Let me get the pick. And there is counter milling in here too. Except chamber two, I guess. That one is smooth. Everything else is counter milled. Very nice one. Thanks, Giovanni. Thanks, Hell Angel, for sending it my way. That's another challenge lock picked and got it. And one more look at the pins. And with that, thank you for watching and enjoy the rest of the day. Bye.